My name's uh, Mike Cook and I'm the head teacher here at uh, Heckman Dwight Grammar School. Um, we have uh, Year 8 behind me enjoying an innovation day uh, where Cummins Turbo Technology staff have come down to help them design and build and race rocket powered vehicles. Today's project started as we saw about the Bloodhound World Speed Record attempt and the Institution of Mechanical Engineers and Engineering UK are assisting with that to use that as an overall concept for encouraging school children to get involved in, in science and technical subjects. But we also get the students to think about things like the safety aspects of it, um, the bodywork, the where can you race a car at a thousand miles an hour, um, the uniforms for the teams, uh, the overall marketing for the, the whole team. We get them to really get the mindset around being what would it really be like to, to be a race team. Even those uh, young people who might previously not have considered you know, being involved uh, at a deep level in, uh, in STEM subject areas uh, may well have had a rethink uh, after today and uh, at least be able to consider that through the industries that are STEM related there are many other aspects to those organisations which the, in which they might make a contribution. Uh, but I've certainly heard uh, examples of young people you know, being surprised themselves in how engaged they've been by these processes today and it may well, uh, it's very likely I think, to affect their decisions uh, that they make going forward into their, their respective futures. Um, we've been split into half our house groups and um, then small groups and that. And we've been able to like each of us focus on like logistics and like mapping and then some of them have done like physics for the cars. Um, we've been able to learn quite a lot of things from the different groups that we've done. Like I've actually been able to learn how to use Google Maps on the computer. Um, it's been really fun. Uh, yeah, I'd, rather, I'd like to do another day like this again because it's been a bit more creative and something different. Yeah, it's made me more interested in the future. It's important that we encourage STEM skills in, in young people because there's a big shortage of technical people, especially going looking forward to the future. And so we need as, as many young people to, to look at STEM subjects as possible. So there are lots of opportunities for them that they don't necessarily understand at the moment. STEM is important because um, the, the uptake of science subjects is recognised as being very, very low. And people, science, uh, and for me as, a, as an engineer in the UK, Knowing that there's there's no succession, people aren't people aren't moving into science and engineering anymore. So STEM, the science, technology, engineering, and maths, com the combination of them brings hopefully the next um, generation of engineers through. We're delighted to be able to uh, have Cummins down here to do this. Uh this activity. There's a, there's a certain amount that we can do in our lessons and through the regular curriculum of course, uh, but a day like today means that we can collapse our timetable, the children can work in teams, they can develop all those other skills that it's difficult for us to work on. I'm thinking about time management, teamwork, communication, planning, uh, you know, learning from failure, creativity, innovation and so on. And so a day like this really focuses all the children on those, those additional skills. Well, there's lots of different things to do and it makes a really good change and it's like a new experience. And yeah, and it kind of helps you for the future to know what to do. And we'd like to say thank you to Cummins for coming in and having such a wonderful day with us. Thank you.